Let's make a Kanye. Okay, what was I gonna do with um I had to make something with a cane pun in the name, right? Oh god. Okay, we're dark and edgy and brooding and indoor in a rainy area, so we can't so we have to be pretty pale, right? A pun with cane in it that hasn't been taken yet. This is gonna take me the better part of an hour probably. Uncanable. Stay free. Too many references in one name. Okay, cool. What the fuck was that? That's your like rank one attack? Like the unleveled. Yeah, that seems fine. There we go. Now the game starts. Come at me, come at me, bros. So this skill like empowers itself after a while. Cause like the the little duder like shoots out. I only have one toggle, don't I? Two? No, the other one is fourth job. Oh no, third job, this one here. Oh, that was fast. Why does it seem like the, the dash up is pretty far, but the dash sideways is not far at all? Oh, sh I think I'm still equipping a level 20 weapon, yeah. Right. As for fourth job skill looking, advanced, deaths, whatever the f cool. Falling, dustbin. 10% final damage, 1% critical damage, and 11% defense ignore for one level. I think I'll put a level in that. That seems like worthwhile. Grinding two, 5% critical damage, 15% final damage for one level. Okay. 1% damage, 5% boss damage for one level. Yeah, these all seem pretty solid. Gain Fortio passives? Dude, they're fing crazy. Mm -mm -mm. I already picked up the pendant, but thanks for reminding me. class <laughs> what is that skill I feel like these skills cartridges replenish like very quickly. You can lose a lot of the you can use a lot of these skills.
That's a lot of damage, this, that skill, right? Or isn't it actually? Yeah. Maybe this one is more damage. <sighs> this character is kind of fun, but it's a bit, it's like a bit much. I'd like a character to be a bit simpler. But yeah, I must say the mobbing felt kind of like eh when I was on, uh, on the test server, but now that I built it up from like the ground and I know all the skills and what they do and everything, they like more organically built that character rather than just jumping on a level 300. Feels way better. Small ones or ones on the ground? Uh, the ones on the ground. The small ones just kind of like do damage whenever they feel like it, right? I guess it gets mainly bossing damage though from those small ones. Because if you're mobbing, they kind of just... Like the monsters are just dying. So they don't have too much stuff that they can go hit, right? Oh shit, wait. If it sucks in the monsters and there's no platform, they fall to the ground. And then the follow-up hit doesn't hit anything. So you have to hit it where there's a platform underneath it. Oh no, I got that one at 160, right. Oh, I got another f***ing skill. Where do I put this sh On F? I guess I don't have a bind. Okay, let's get some damage on this boy. Can I hit this one yet? Okay. Ouch, heal please. Oh, I didn't charge it, my bad. Oh, weapon defense. Ooh, I just saw you use your strongest skill. Or your second strongest skill. Let me just get in, pop into weapon defense real quick. Get out. Priceless pictures will fly like birds and out of this earth. I'm turn and hearts this figure. So Kane is all about just using whatever skill is up, I guess. Use stuff off cooldown. It's like the fire poison mage of archers, I guess. <laughs> Beautiful. It's like a plastic love rework? Yeah. I was gonna say, this reminds me of plastic love. Oh, didn't empower. Wait, if you empower it, you can't use it again, but if you use it empowered first, then you can use. Cringe, bro. Like it so far. Um. Yeah, it's not too bad. I think I might be making it a little bit more complicated than it needs to be, though. It feels a little bit too heavy on the, like, the amount of skills that you have. I feel like you have too many skills, and then all of them has an empowered version on top of that. Like, it feels a bit too much. But I guess nobody's saying that you have to use all of them. I must say, a character is pretty busted. These are level 190 monsters. Most characters at 180 kind of struggle with these stumps. Kind of have trouble killing them. This guy, not so much. Everything is sound. Somehow I did too many things at once. I don't remember what channel I was in. So it was only two more minutes, so I don't think we're gonna. <laughs> don't think we're gonna get it. With how strong, uh, how strong and how fast this character is, and with all the level up potions and all the boosting, you still can't done, can't get it done in two totems. Two hundred. Easy clap. First level 200, world first. You saw it here first chat. Clap us. Clap for me. Rank one. 
Level 200. No one's ever done this before. New class. Oh my god. Amazing. Fifth Daijobu. Give me that. Get out of the way. Ah, oh, beautiful. Why would you make such a beautiful animation? And then cover it with a text chat. Dragon burst. A oh, burst and makes me feel good. How do I like Kane? Um, I like that it's interactive and it's not just like hold down one button, things die. But it's, I think it's a little too much. Like there's a very delicate balance where I think this one is probably a little bit too far. And I think it's because of the the empowerment thing being active. But I, I understand that they wouldn't do that passively. I think uh, what I would like is if there was a toggle option to automatically empower the next skill. That for mobbing you can turn that on and then for bossing you would turn it off and min-max your own damage more. Dude, that was not five seconds. Rough. Hmm. I'm equipping that one skill. It's specifically good for bosses hurting me a little bit here. Dude, I didn't even see that blue cloud, but I still dodged it. Oh my god. Oh my god, it's all put it out of my damage. Die, please. 